Yo, what's up guys? Yeah, Poe Game here. Today we're using Mono Throat Spray on the OU ladder. Shout out to RTSK for the team. If you guys do enjoy this type of content, let me know and make sure you subscribe. On my way to 264,000 subscribers. But let's go over the team real quick, which you guys can also get on my website, pogaming.com. But we have Throat Spray combo with Clanger Soul to set up, uh, as well as Clanging Scales, Boom Burst, Norse Fear. Boom Burst is here just because it's a good neutral hit on like fairies and stuff like that. But I could just go Flash Cannon too. Boom Burst is just really strong though, so uh, I'll see if I end up changing it. We have Shift Gear Toxicity, I have Snarl just because Dragapult is a little bit annoying to take out with certain members. So having Snarl, knocking it out at plus one, also just lowering the special attack of other Pokemon seems pretty good. Uh, we do have Sub 3 attacks Primarina, I might make this Calm Mind over Sub though, uh, just to see if it helps it break a little bit more. But um, we have Sticky Wet from Rebombi, and of course we have the Throat Spray with that too, with the Bug Buzz and Stun Spores here, because I want to try and weaken or slow down even Pokemon like uh, Heatran, which aren't that fast for my team, but in general can still be annoying. We have Selgar with the Throat Spray on Burden, with Bug Buzz, Focus Blast, Slash Bomb, and Spikes, and then we have four attacks x block because we're about to get loud with this Mon, so... Let's go ahead and look for a game. Hopefully, we can get some wins with Mono Throat Spray today. This is probably the uh, the weakest looking team in terms of me using Mono items in OU. I'm pretty sure none of these Mons, <laughs> none of these Mons are OU right now. So um, we'll see how that ends up going. Yeah, we'll definitely see how this ends up going. It looks like Toxtricity is really good here. Uh, I need to break you that way I can win with one of these Mons. And if I beat Ferrothorn, I think that Toxtricity can win. Um, but definitely going to be annoying, especially because Lele is such a big threat uh, versus me immediately. Hmm. I can try and stun Spore stuff. This is actually really good in this game. Like, low-key. Uh, you have three Pokemon that can deal with it, but it, it actually messes up others, which I really like. I'm going to start with a Selgorp. See if I can uh, get up a spike early and wear down Ferrothorn and whatnot. Uh, I'm not sure if this is Scarf Landers or not, honestly, based on their build at all. But... Again, a good bit of chip damage always goes, you know, it goes a long way. Especially if they go Top of Fini now and I can weaken that with Sludge Bomb. Or if they go Ferrothorn and I can land a Focus Blast, that'd be amazing. Uh, though I would go for Bug Buzz first versus that. Right, we're just going to Sludge Bomb you. Maybe go for a Poison if we can. As we unfortunately die there. <laughs> um, using Toxtricity to weaken Ferrothorn. That way I can try and win with... Uh, that way I can try and win with Primarina. Sounds okay. So I'm going to go Toxtricity here. I'm just going to click Boom Burst. It's a really strong move <laughs> versus their squad. And uh, only to, uh, Ferrothorn can take it. I, originally this was potentially Drain Punch over uh, Snarl. But I really, really, really do like the Snarl. Uh, I'm surprised my opponent was willing to give me their Tornadus. But I'll take it for sure. But she, I, I doubt that's their Defogger. Or maybe it was. Who knows? They go Ferrothorn after. Uh, I'm, I'm just going to click Boom Burst here and try and get as much damage off on this thing as possible. I am, like I said, pretty weak to this guy. And I will bring out Exploud now. Exploud hits very hard versus their team. Hmm. I'll just click Boom Burst and see how they react. Plus I get the Throat Spray now, so the next one's going to hit them. Woo, that did so much damage. Yo, so my next one's a guaranteed kill even after uh, Leftovers. Let's hope I'm faster. I'm only 235 speed. But if I get rid of this, that's... They still have Lanterns, so I can still Defog too. Oh, I'm hella okay with them going on to this mod. Yo, x putting in some work right now. We already have that in range of the other Boom Burst too, so that's amazing. And I can just click Fire Blast here and knock them out. As they double out to Tapu Fini. Hey, bro. Just, just give me this mod already. You can double around all you want, fam. I'm going to keep clicking Boom Burst into Fire Blast. It's just strong versus you. Plus, I have Scrappy. So, great, we get rid of Tapu Fini, which means I more than likely keep the spike. I would have loved to KO all these other mons too, but yeah, this is the mon I needed to come in after. So, Lele comes out. Knocks me out with a Psychic. I need to force this to take another round of spike, if possible. I wonder if you're Specs. I'm just going to go for Sparkling Aria. Okay, that is Specs, great. So, I'm in Torrent now, which means they should be close to dying. Yeah, that's, that's hella specs, though. So we can bring out Rabombi now. They die. 
go for Bug Buzz just because I get the uh, the throat spray here. They died a spike, which should mean I'm able to set up and win, I think. I think. It could be Scarf Dragapult, though. Just in case it is Scarf Dragapult, I'm going for Sicky Web there. As I die there, I send out you and I go for Clangor Soul, and I think I win. I think. Let's see, because I get my throat spray here, obviously. Yes. They lead see me there. Gonna Aura Sphere. I wish I had Flamethrower in this point at this point in the game. I really do. But we get rid of them. Awesome. And now I can click my dragon move twice. Unless this was Scarf Landers the whole time. Nice! Hey, we won. We won. Yeah, Dragon Pull can't beat me. If it was Scarf, now the sticky web has slowed it down. And uh, if it's any other if it was heavy to do boots, I'm already faster anyway. So we end up winning. Nice. We pushed the 1700 with the team. Not bad at all. Alright, I'm happy about that. Team put in work. And the sticky web ended up working out. The spike ended up working out. Oh, they have an unburdened mon on their team too. Sick. Um, I'm pretty Zapdos weak, but they're very Xblood weak, so that's something to keep in mind. I'm gonna start with a Selgor and just try and get up as many spikes as possible. Actually, a bit of damage on Swampert never hurt anybody, so. Yeah, a bit of, a bit of damage on uh, Zapdos didn't hurt anybody either. Uh, one Mon I can definitely win with is Como here. I just need damage on Hippo as well, but. Ooh, I get a crit, Poison? As they Volt Switch there, uh, that's amazing, they can't Revenge Kill me. Hopefully they go out to something like Scarf Kartana. It's because I'm faster and they didn't see that Unburden activated, even though they have an Unburden Mon themselves. Oh, okay, I mean, I'll take you. Nice, so they get their Endeavor there, which is unfortunate. Mm, you're really good in this game. All right, you do not knock me out. So I'm gonna go for Sun Spore here. I'm gonna go for Sun Spore here if possible. Yes, I do land, which is awesome. And what I can do is go for Sticky Web now. They could have Magic Coat, but I'm gonna risk it anyway. It's all right if we get double Sticky Web up, I think. While Kartana's still faster and everything, that it's, <laughs> well, maybe it wasn't all right. <laughs> It's fine though, they actually gave me damage on Hippo, which is what I needed as well to win. So I will gladly, gladly take that, especially because we can go Primarina now. And we're going to sub up on the Slurp of Sack. Nice. So Slurp of dies to Sand. Primarina is still faster than Swampert. It's not faster than you, that's for sure. But whatever comes in is going to get smashed by this, so... Because you will be, you hopefully will be 2 ko and I'm max special. Oh, you're definitely 2 ko after Throat Spray for sure, yep. Alright, so we get rid of that. We've weakened Hippo. So the next one KOs you. Awesome. Do they Smart Strike win now? <laughs> I don't even know if Zapdos knocks me out. Cart definitely knocks me out. I can't really stop it from getting a Beast Boost, so... They go for Leaf Blade out. I'm gonna go Como. Set up a Clangor Soul. I have Hippo in range. I have Zapdos in range now. Landers dies. Nice. So I get my little boost there. I don't think Scarf Cart will kill me. I'm just gonna Boom Burst here and get rid of you. I think this wins. Also, if it's not Scarf Cart, I definitely KO it, so. For sure. Like, I for sure KO it. Oh, do you guys think Landers dies? It should, right? If this is Scarf Landers and it's not Scarf Cart, then we should win anyway. It should die, right? Oh, no, they are potentially Scarf. I should have Boom Bursted there then. I'm most likely killed. Because now I'm lowered defenses. It's going to come down to these guys. Oof! I lived! 
Oh, and it was just leftovers, so maybe if it wasn't Scarf Car, I might have just thrown. I just boom burst there. No, it was leftovers, land. It was just max speed. That's unfortunate. So Cartana should win here. Mmm. Yeah. Ah, uh, good game. I'm not sure if it was Bandit or Scarf there at the end. So, uh, I guess in front of Landers, uh, another shift gear could have worked. But if it was Scarf, Earthquake definitely put me in range of um, at least Sand, right? I don't think I'd be able to shift gear again. All right, this is gonna be dumb. this is gonna be very tough. I do want Webs up for at least. Well, they have a Bisharp, but I mean, I still want Webs up. Yeah, I'm still going for webs, despite them. Actually, let me bug buzz here. I do a lot. Plus, I can stun spore the, uh... Goodbye, my child. I just moon blast there. I think I still go for sticky web regardless. Just for Garchomp. As they land a hypnosis, which is very unfortunate. Um, okay. How do I stop Volcarona? I think I go you and sub. Sub again. I'm just trying to stall out Veil turns. Nice, I'm in Torrent. I set up Spike, Garchomp gets weakened. You're the only mon that could literally, like, I could eat a hit. <laughs> so we'll go you. The Aura Sphere to knock you out. Volcarona comes out and I just Clangor Soul. Probably just died of Psychic, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, Primarina was my way versus that. Is a wrap, bros. All right, so one and two, one and two. Volcarona though is extremely diff. Is there a throat spray mon I can? Hmm. Hmm. You, but you also lost to that. Maybe I should have went combo first and then let that thing set up. But after the spikes, it was rough. Or the alternative was leading off with you to do even more damage to Mew, and then hopefully be forced into X Blob. All right, we're one and two with the team. It's okay though. It's okay. Um, Toxtricity looks incredible here. Thank you. Have fun. I have Snarl, so I got rid of both their ghost types, which is amazing. I'm gonna go Exploit. Have fun. I'm gonna go Exploit early just so I can start breaking. Uh, it, it forces Draco Meteor from Dragapult so I can get up Sticky Web and then try and get in Toxtricity. If that is specially defensive Landers, it's a problem. But this guy should die to plus one Boom Burst. These guys died to the Snarl at plus one from Toxtricity. So, I have options. I got options. Uh, but, uh, yeah, so there's the Pult lead. They have to spec Draco to kill me. I'm just going to go for uh, Boom Burst here. I wonder if they're calcing spec Draco. I mean, it, it definitely kills me. Explode. Dragon Pult. Draco does 98 to 116. Let's assume that I am max HP. Yeah, please go ahead and assume this. Please assume that I'm max HP because I have a bunch of fairies. I mean, Primarina is really good here too. I'm just going to Boom Burst. Yeah, okay, good. Good, good, good. So go Corviknight, which is what I want. Yep. Corviknight's exactly what I want. So now I can knock them out with Fire Blast. I think they're going to assume that too. Uh, I'm just going to go for another Boom Burst. Yes. Okay, we get rid of Dragapult. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Giant Threat, Giant Threat gone. Blacephalon comes out and has to go for a Fire move. Which lets Como set up. I'm gonna sack that to overheat. Perfect. That specs. If I go Rebombi and stun spore them, I'm in a good spot. I do kinda wanna Ugh. spike doesn't matter. I need to weaken landers. 
All right, so you're my best play. I just come in and click uh, Moon Blast now. Oh my god, that did so much damage. Why did that do so much damage? <laughs> I'm going to go Rabombi here. As a pain split, and I'm going to go for... Uh, go for a Bug Buzz, just because it's stronger. We do manage to live, which is awesome. We can Moon Blast now. As Corviknight comes out, we're just going to Stun Spore them as well. Oh shoot, are we going to beat E1v1? I might as well try and go for it. And now we'll just sticky wet for Bacephalon as we ideally die there. Okay, so Toxtricity comes in. Very good play on the opponent's part. Very, very, very good play. So they have to either Shadow Ball or Overheat here. I'm gonna go Como because I'm bulletproof. They opt to Flamethrower, which is honestly just as good. I'll be real, that's a really good play as well. I'm gonna double to Rabambi on what I'm expecting to be Clef. As they click double flame again. Alright, you got me, buddy. Just gonna sparkle now. I got a sparkle in a Rotom. Um, I'm not sure if it's fully special defensive or not, but I'm gonna go for double sparkle. Because. Uh, <sighs> Volt Switch doesn't knock me out, so whatever comes in dies. Yep, whatever comes in dies now. Clef dies. Corva dies. keep you alive just because you're very strong I guess I'm just gonna go for it with toxicity right like that's just it <laughs> well they get to go into Blissef right now though okay they went Lando first which is great a little bit of chip on them I don't know if you're faster than this but Ah, uh, that's going to do too much damage, isn't it? I should have just hit them before. They're probably calculating that I don't dot anything, and they just win. Unless they go Clef after. So what I should have done was uh, just Moonblast into that. Yeah, this just knocks me out. Good game, fam. Okay, so when they got me in the Corviknight play. If I killed Corviknight there, uh, it would open up at least a Selgore to weaken some things, but... Also, I should just moon blast him more and wrote him. So one and three with the team. Don't worry, we're gonna get wins. We're gonna get wins. Versus Molly. <laughs> Maybe we should put some OU Pokemon. Is there anything that I can get throat spray on with in OU that Snarl Hydreigon has nasty plot? <laughs> like, hmm. And they have Slow King, which single-handedly walls my entire team. Good mon, good mon, good mon. Also pretty freaking weak to you, Zero Aura. <laughs> Holy crap, Zero Aura is annoying. Can't even stun spore and it probably has heavy duty boots. Okay. Mmm. Do I like sub on this thing? I kinda like com I kinda think in combine might be better. How'd I beat Zero Aura? I literally have to lead Como so I don't lose to Zera Ori immediately. <laughs> That's amazing. These future sides are going to be so problematic too. Alright, they end up leading Lanners. I'm going to try and weaken this thing immediately. Yeah, I'm just going to try and weaken this thing immediately. That's going to help out my Toxtricity in the back, so... Uh, again, I don't know if they're Scarf or not. If they're special defensive, the damage early is going to help a lot too. Actually, initially I should go for Boom Burst just because I don't want to take the defense drop. Alright, so we get big damage off on Landers. Awesome. Worth. That's worth. I'm just going to go for Bug Buzz here just in case there's Scarf because it does 2 KO me with Earthquake. <laughs> Scarf, Scarf Landers does 2 KO with Earthquake, so... 
Uh, I need the Umberton to be faster. But I got a little bit of chip, which is really good for Toxtricity. The Toxtricity knocks that out now. For sure. They can go out into Corviknight pretty safely now, but that's the position I want. So that way I can get in Toxtricity and set up, and then try and win with that. Ideally. Maybe they're not heavy duty boots on the Pokemon that always runs it, aka Slow King. Alright, so we get some chip on you too with Sludge Bomb. Big damage. As they Moonblast <laughs> drop my special attack. But we did get rid of Clefable, and Clefable's always an annoying Pokemon too. Honestly. <laughs> it is always an annoying Pokemon too. I wish I still had my special attack drop. If they go Heatran, I'm gonna Moon uh, I'm gonna Focus Blast. If they go Corviknight, I'm going to Spike for Heatran. Basically, one way to get damage on Corver, uh, on that and over the other, you know? So. Spike up. The problem with Shift Gear is that it doesn't activate my Throat Spray. So I have to attack to get it. Psychic is there for Tox Effects, but it hasn't really been working out. Oh, so again, um, in October... I'm going to start doing really serious lives where I'm just like, well, not like everything. I mean, obviously I use fun Pokemon, but like lives where I get to, um, I'm actually aiming for like the top and stuff like that. So right now I'm just enjoying my time. <laughs> Truthfully. Okay. If they miss Stone Edge, this is fine. They go Heatran, which is probably ideal for me. Gonna sparkle right now. Gonna sub up. Ooh, he took some big damage. And now we can sparkle after. So we get rid of Slow King. Awesome. Obviously, my sub's gonna break and they can bring out Zero Aura. <laughs> oh, Sticky Web would have been huge here. Alright, it's time to shift gear up. I think x block can win, actually. I need this thing to stay paralyzed. Please just stay paralyzed forever. Please stay paralyzed. Stay paralyzed. Stay paralyzed. Stay paralyzed. Stay paralyzed. Alright, well, gotta get up Sticky Web, which still doesn't make me faster than, uh, than Zerora, but, you know, we can hope. Bug bus spit up drop. Bug bus spit up drop. Bug bus spit up drop. Yeah. More bug bus spit up drops. Why would you not just go Corviknight now and just mess me up? <sighs> I can't even hit this thing. I don't even know if Surf kills. <laughs> Good game. Alright, so one and four. One and four, man. Damn it, this is really tough. Okay. And now I'm fighting Umbreon, the mon that walls my entire team. JK, that's toxic effects. Nah, um, Primary is really good. Like, really, 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 really good. Some of my opponent's team stays as slow as that I'm hoping it is. I'm going to use X-Plot early and try and break as early as possible. Rotom is annoying for, uh, like, on a 1v1 scale. Always boom burst, get my special attack raised. Please be faster. You should be rock, so I'm hoping... And you should be physically defensive, considering your team. Oh, I just boom burst again. Let's go. Please be little crappy Umbreon with foul play heal bell. And don't be toxic. That's what I like to see. 51, not bad. Just gonna boom burst again. <laughs> this is 140. This is... Uh, this is 140 times 1 by 5, and this is, uh, what is it, 240? So this is 210 versus uh, 240. I'm just going to go for this again. I uh, can't miss, so. Time to miss! Go to miss. Nice. So now they can toxic me if they have it. They don't have toxic. We wasted a few wishes and protects. 
Ooh, spit up drop! Yeah! You gotta switch into a boom burst now. You gotta, come on, bring in Rotom, let it die. Bring in Landers, let it die. Bring in Toxapex, let it get to a KO'd. Switch into this. Come on, you have to. I'm one in four, I wanna win. Just gonna Fire Blast in case they go Mel Metal that turn. We're gonna Boom Burst again. Again, I don't have to click anything else in these other situations. You have a Snorlax. I would like it to die though. Nice, you're gonna take a million damage, let's go. Do you have Baneful Bunker? I feel like you're a Baneful Bunker. Okay, so this being weakened is really, 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 really good. I just need it weakened. So I'm going for Fire Blast. Burn it. <laughs> Alright, so unfortunately I still have a little crappy Umbreon. Mm. Gonna bring out you. I think Overdrive kills, so I'm gonna go for it. I could go Lando, but I digress. Go Umbreon instead. This should kill. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Thank for the crit. All right, so you beat little crappy Umbreon. You're the a giant threat. I think we win. Bro, you die. Get the hell out of here. Get out of here. So in order for Toxapex to win, they need to go Toxapex and switch back. Wait, they went Snorlax. I have Oris here, my friend. I'm sorry. Yeah, we were prepared for you. We were prepared for you. So at this point, even if they go Toxapex and go Melmetal and go back to Toxapex, it's the same thing. I still win. So, yeah. Because I have a Primarina that subs and messes them up. Also, Pex living doesn't mean it lives the next one. So, yep. Sorry, buddy. Now they have to switch out to Rotom and let it die. Funnily enough, in this situation, Toxapex could win the 1v1. Like with what's left. Goodbye, Rotom. You still do 31? Nice. Right, 2 and 4. 2 and 4, guys. 2 and 4. Can we make it 4 and 4? Most likely not. The more we play, the harder it gets. We get Assault Vest Slow King. Walls my entire team. <laughs> yes! Do I still like Sticky Web here? I do. Very much. I'm actually, I'm going for them. They're amazing here. So, yep. This mod is also really good versus me, but we get a Sticky Web now. Toxtricity is good. Maybe Snarl will let me live Psychics. But yeah, Sticky Web are really nice because uh, my Toxtricity is strong. This mon is a good Toxtricity check though, so don't get me wrong. Uh, obviously, the Corviknight is one too. That's Specs, and I get crit turn one. I think I live Specs Volt Switch. Yeah, probably like 12%. Like and I can click Stun Spore on something coming in. I wonder if that's Banded or, or Heavy Duty Boots. Okay. So, they go Corviknight, I bring out Toxtricity, obviously. They go Weave Out. I don't know. I mean, they go Slow King, I, I forfeit. <laughs> Alright, so Weave Out is there. I'm gonna bring out you and just Fire Blast. Focus Blast is also pretty good, too. Yeah, I'm gonna Fire Blast. Please do enough. Big damage. Okay. So I knock him out with the next one. Alright. This is, I think, Tank Chomp on this team, so... That doesn't matter, I think. Yeah, they just get up Stealth Rock there and die. <laughs> Alright, so we get... We have Garchomp weakened for Toxtricity now. Um, we don't have an item, so low kick... I mean, <laughs> knock off or whatever the move from Weavile isn't going to kill me. I'm fairly confident we beat Sloking 1v1. And again, Sticky Web being up is just amazing. So, yeah, let's get rid of the Garchomp there. Perfect. 
And then letting me keep Sticky Webber really, really big. It's so... I, I, it's amazing. And also Slow King has the Future Sight and then, and then sack something into it. So it's looking all right. Because I boom burst three times and get kills. Yep. Oh, they pl they sludge bomb poison me, which is a little bit unfortunate. I would I would say. All right, so they KO me there. I want to say that we go Primarina now and just go for more sparkling because I think this thing messes up everything they have on their team. Because I knock out Slow King. I knock out Corvin and get my boost, which means they can't default, which means I'm always faster than Urshifu with my team. Yep. Your specs. I'm going to assume you die. <laughs> I don't know if that crit mattered, but I'm fairly confident that <laughs> it didn't. <laughs> I really don't think it mattered. But if it did, that's life. All right. Three and four. Three and four. Can we break even, guys? Can we break even? I hope so. I hope so. Let me tell him. Throat spray everything with toxicity explode. And come on. But you don't need me to add come on. To be honest. Oh no. Oh no. A recognizable team. A very strong recognizable team. Ah, zone is annoying. Um, Lando, I want to weaken with Rabambi. Rabambi's good. Rabambi just weakening things is really good. I can see Xblood winning this, but also I could see myself losing the Dragonite. This is Dragonite's over DD, I'm pretty sure, too. Como is good if I weaken this. I think Como actually wins if I weaken this, so I'm going to try and weaken that early with. Hmm. Actually, I'm going to go with Sago early. And there's, there's two things are going to happen. I'm either going to lose immediately to Dragonite setting up, or I'm going to get to weaken the Tapu Fini, which is what I want. So, yeah, there's a that could happen. But I want Spike up for Tapu Fini. I think it's Scarfini. How much does Boombers do at plus one, plus two? No. No, 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 no. Get your fake damage out of here. That really only does 58 to 69? That's crazy, bro. I'll just bug buzz turn one as they go zone. They run a balloon. I'm just going to focus blast and knock you out. All right, so we get rid of that immediately to probably just lose to Dragonite, right? <laughs> like legitimately just lose to Dragonite out. But I could be Sash on Rabombi, so they don't know that I'm throw spray everything. I want them to go top of Fini now. Please get the poison immediately. Please get the poison immediately. Thank you. Okay. So they might not know. So this is going to do double that damage. Plus poison. And I'm faster than them if they get plus two. Yep. Yes. The unburdened tech, baby. I'm faster. Let's go. Let's go. Yo, I think I just won. <laughs> I could be wrong, but the two biggest threats of my team are dead. And that did a lot of damage too? Oh, hell yeah. I'm getting up a spike as well for later. Let's be safe here. Have another bug buzz. Get some damage off on you. All right. Leaf Blade, Smart Strike. A lot of things can sweep me. What is my best option now? You keeping you alive. Smart strike. I don't think smart strike can see me actually. I think it's to go you and click boom burst. I think so. Because yeah, as long as I have all these homies alive, I don't know if there's one move that I don't think smart strike will kill me. Well, this one for sure obviously would die to Sacred Sword. Like, there's no stopping that. Um, Bug Buzz here, which knock you out in response. Also, this mod is just very strong versus these mods in general. 
So I can actually just Moonblast you. Drop its special attack, which is pretty cool as well. And I think I stick you up here. Which means I can bring out Como. Knock you out with Boom Burst while getting my special attack boost, and I think we win. Ah, close, 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 close. Triple Axe knocks me out. I don't think I need you. I don't want to lose the Smart Strike, man. I don't think Como dies to plus one from a Scarf Cartana. And if it's Bandit Cart, then Como is obviously faster. So I believe the play is to bring out Primarina. Just click Moonblast here. And plus one Smart Strike should not be able to knock out Como. And this this kills this kills Weavile. Nice. Should not be able to knock Akomo on one. Yeah, good game. All right, so we went four and four, which honestly, considering I had zero OU Pokemon and the my team's base speed is like five, ignore us, Al Gore. I'm very happy that we went four and four with this. I could go for one more and try and get a win, but then what if I get a loss and then I have to get one more after that and the video just goes on forever. But four and four with Mono Throat Spray, considering... <laughs> We went one and four into three wins. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I hope y'all enjoyed. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe. Thank you about for watching. If you did enjoy, leave a like and subscribe. Also, feel free to check out my Patreon content. I'm uploading every single day. I've been uploading, uh, well, today will be, I think, part of my Rambats Road Top 10. But uh, I've been uploading Unite every other day as well on there. So between that and Shared on Lives. But if you want to check me out on Patreon. And also, feel free to follow me on Twitch because I've been streaming every day too. And once that gets to 100k, I'm doing a road top 10 and OU on Twitch. And obviously, I'll port and do parts for YouTube as well. But um, you gotta get to 100k followers first. But yeah, I hope y'all enjoy. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.